Have you ever wondered about the intricate and fascinating world of octopus mating? You might be surprised to learn that it's a dance of life and death, a ballet of danger and desire, a complex and risky ritual unlike any other in the animal kingdom. In the great depths of the ocean, where the sun's rays barely reach, the octopus begins its pursuit of procreation. Male octopuses, armed with a specialized arm known as a hectocotylus, embark on a mission to find a suitable mate. This arm, a spectacle of evolution, is used to transfer a package of sperm to the female, a process that's not as straightforward as it sounds. It's a risky business, this octopus courtship. Males must approach females with caution, as females are often larger and might not hesitate to turn a potential mate into a meal. The male octopus must use every ounce of his cunning and agility to ensure survival and successful mating. Some males opt for a distant approach, extending their hectocotylus from a safe space to deposit the sperm. Others choose a more intimate route, inserting the arm into the female's mantle cavity, an act that requires trust and precision. The female octopus, once she has received the sperm, stores it until she's ready to fertilize her eggs. This may not happen immediately. She waits for the optimal conditions to ensure the highest chance of survival for her offspring. But the male's job doesn't end with the transfer of sperm. In some species, he stands guard, protecting the female and the future offspring from potential predators. This act of protection, however, often comes with a cost. The male octopus, having fulfilled his purpose, typically dies soon after mating. The female, after laying thousands of eggs, dedicates the remainder of her life to their care. She guards them, cleans them, and ensures they have the best possible start in life. Once the eggs hatch, the mother octopus, exhausted and spent, usually succumbs to a similar fate as the male. So the dance of the octopus, a fascinating journey of survival, procreation, sacrifice and death, is a testament to the incredible adaptability and complexity of life beneath the waves. To summarize, the octopus mating process is a delicate balance of risk and reward. It begins with a careful approach by the male, the transfer of sperm using a specialized arm, and often ends with the male's death. The female then stores the sperm until she's ready to fertilize her eggs. After laying her eggs, she dedicates herself to their care until they hatch, often dying soon after. It's a cycle of life, death, and rebirth that continues to captivate and astound scientists and marine enthusiasts alike.